expedition out of the way. This is a great opportunity for the guys to relax. Jim Nance and Julianne McNamara back in St. Louis, halfway through the women's competition. Donnie Thompson is leading in 19th place. You'll notice the name of Summer Reed. <laughs> Reed is an East teammate and confidant of Donnie Thompson, but Summer is hoping to find a career one day in television. And this week we gave her a chance to audition. This is really funny. <laughs> Hi, I'm Summer Reed, and I'm auditioning for CBS. And I'm here in St. Louis, Missouri for the Olympic Festival. And I'm competing here with Donnie Thompson, who's my teammate on the East team. And we're just talking about <laughs> gymnastics. <laughs> uh, is this your first Olympic festival? Yes. How does it feel? It's exciting. Okay. <laughs> what else am I supposed to say? Well, thanks, Donnie, for joining me. And this is Summer Reed with the CBS. Well done, Summer. Thank you. We'll save the tape. And Donnie Thompson on the floor right now. Four foot seven, 73 pounder, who lives in Colorado Springs. She does a triple turn here. Very big requirement and difficult to do right before a difficult tumbling run. Full twisting, double back. Well done. Donnie really plays the crowd. She's having a good time out there. She gets the crowd behind her. One and a half twist, flip up, lay out, step out. Not as difficult as some of the middle passes you'll see. Setting up for her last tumbling run, trying to get a deep breath. Two and a half twists. Right into a front hand spring. Little Donnie Thompson capturing a lot of hearts here in St. Louis. And there's Summer Reed to greet her. Coach Tom Forster. She just popped into his training academy at the age of five. And that's how it all started. 9.85. <laughs> now back to Kelly Davis in third place. She does the same mount we saw Donnie Thompson do earlier. Oh. As I talked about, it's very difficult. Her hips were out of line. It pulled her off of the balance beam. That's a big deduction, five-tenths of a point. Davis back up on the beam. Let's shift over now to Christy Powell. Donnie Thompson's East teammate and also training partner back at Tom Forster's Academy in Colorado Springs. Jim, this is the most difficult tumbling run being done in this competition. Double layout backflip. Great height. but she shows a very good style. Very creative dance moves and beautiful form. Here's a second tumbling run. Pike front step out into a one and a half twisting laid out front flip known as a Rudy. This is Christie's favorite event. She says, I can show off my personality. She is spunky and enthusiastic on the floor. And for her young age, she shows a lot of maturity. Difficult.
difficult last pass. Double cut. Beautiful. Good height. To me, that's what gymnastics is all about. Incredible power and beautiful artistry. The thing that's amazing about this first tumbling run, it actually looks like she goes higher on the second flip. She's totally laid out in the air. Beautiful form. And you're so tired at the end of a floor exercise, a minute 30, here's a big burst of energy to get great height. And that performance by Christy Powell merits a 9.9. .9. How about this combo from Colorado Springs? And while Powell finished on the floor, Kelly Davis on the beam scored a 9.2, really doomed right from the start. Well, it's a gymnast's nightmare to mount the equipment and have an immediate fall. It's so difficult to regain your concentration when you know you've fallen and you have to finish up with a routine. Kelly drops from third to tenth place. So after three of four events, Thompson has expanded her overall lead, and Christy Powell jumped up from 14th to 